Hey guys, what's up? This is Osprey, and first of all, Happy New Year. Sorry I have not been posting in about two weeks. Uh, I just got sidetracked with some other stuff. Never really got around to recording or editing. So, I am back, and as you can tell, I have Black Ops too. <laughs> uh, I got it for Christmas, you know, because I wasn't going to spend money on it, but kind of wish I'd gotten it a little bit earlier. It is pretty enjoyable. Um, this whole pick 10 system is pretty cool for your classes. I tend to use this crazy combo of an MP7 with a DSR-50 as my secondary. Kind of mess up here with the Hellstorm because that dude runs into a building. But uh, pretty much this gameplay, it's T Timmy Deathmatch. I forget the name of the map because this was probably one of my first days. And I go 19-2 and two in this game. Now, I'm fast forwarding here because sometimes it happens in Call of Duty where you just run around and cannot find anyone. But uh, pretty much, just wanted to say I will be uploading more frequently. I will try to at least. And uh, probably going to get back on Battlefield soon because there's actually double XP for the next few days. So uh, I will be uploading Battlefield 3 as well as Call of Duty because, uh, like I said, Call of Duty is kind of fun now, you know. I was very hesitant to get this game after Modern Warfare 3 completely failed me like i was totally disappointed with it but this game is pretty pretty well uh well-rounded you know on, nothing's too op now after that patch apparently and uh there. the fact that you can get diamond on a gun is pretty crazy but uh anyway i'm using the very basic kill streaks now because i'm a new one Nah, no, but I was just trying to get the game before I actually start venturing off into the high kill streak. Kind of sucks now is that UAVs take so many more points than they used to. If you remember, they used to be like three kills, and now you have to get like 425 points or something. But uh, it's cool because this game actually gives you points for UAV assists or destroying different uh, equipment. So it kind of does pay off there. But uh, yeah. I'm very happy with this game, and right up here, kind of sucks I die because their spawn changes at the last second and I get uh, flanked, and I really didn't have uh, anything to do here, but uh, yeah, this game is pretty fun. I'm working on uh, getting gold camo for my MP7 before I move on to the other SMGs. It just takes a lot of headshots, and a good thing about this game is that uh, when you prestige, you keep all of your camo, you keep all of the stats on your gun, so it's not like when you prestige you basically start the game over again. In fact, you have to prestige to be able to experience every single weapon. So that kind of makes me think that uh, Treyarch did this on purpose to force you to prestige because a lot of people used to complain about the prestiging system as being totally pointless because then you lose everything. But, uh... Yeah, this game, I, I think it's a much better version. I'm I'm starting to lean towards the uh, Treyarch Call of Duties over the Infinity Ward ones. Because uh, the Infinity Wars ones pretty much just all look the same, except with a new background and new maps. It's pretty much just one big DLC from the last game. But uh, yeah, guys, this has been Osprey. Happy New Year. I hope you enjoy 2013. After this, there's going to be a few funny clips. So, uh, well, not funny, but just check them out. See you guys.